Hey everybody, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com and we're going to be taking a quick look at the Pacer Brake Logic module. Now this allows you to add in a third or center brake light on your trailer or your vehicle. So if you want to put this on an RV or really anything else and you're adding in that third brake light, this allows you to do that. Basically what it does is it allows you to tap into your wiring from the factory or from uh, maybe a four pole wiring harness and it will filter out the turn signals so that you're not getting a flash on that center brake. Uh, you're only going to get the brake signal. So it only comes on when you hit the brakes rather than coming on if the turn signals are activated. So it just is pretty simple to wire up. Um, you might want to watch out for putting too much power through this. Some customers have said that if you put through more than 1.5 amps, it won't work. So just keep that in mind. Will work out pretty well for most LED lights though, since they have a pretty low power draw. There's just three wires to worry about. The green wire is what's going to actually go to your center brake light. And then you'd want to, of course, ground that brake light out. The other two wires, one is going to go to your right turn signal the other is going to go to your left turn signal. doesn't really matter which wire you use. They're just there to get the signal and then filter it out so that brake signal can work. This little guy is just that uh, kind of the brains of the operation. So you want to make sure that maybe you uh, zip tie this off to some existing wiring or just kind of zip tie it off to something so that it's not bouncing around all over the place. But it should be pretty straightforward as far as that goes. This can be used on any kind of domestic vehicle that uses a single filament bulb. You just really want to use this anytime you're using a single light as that third brake light. So maybe again, you're adding in a LED strip to your truck or another vehicle and adding in that third brake light function. This will allow you to use that and not have it flash. As far as the size, I'll give you some quick measurements here. We'll get about, about nine and a half inches of wire to work with. Call it about nine of really usable length there. And the little module itself is just about an inch or seven eighths of an inch long and about five eighths or maybe three quarters of an inch in diameter. So pretty small, pretty easy to set up just about anywhere you want to. Now, if you need some, uh, but connectors to go with this, you can find a lot of options here at eTrailer.com. I would probably suggest using the pink ones. Those will be for your smaller gauge wire, which this looks like it's about 18 gauge. Um, so that will probably do you if you're connecting it to anything that's a little bigger, you probably want to go with the blue, which is for 16 to 14 gauge wire. But you can find all of those here at eTrailer.com to go with this install. And I hope this has been helpful in deciding if this is going to be the right part for you. We do have a lot of other lighting accessories and wiring here at eTrailer.com for all kinds of stuff. So check it out. Thanks for watching.